Do you think that there's a usefulness in having a, a nemesis to motivate you, talking about some of the situations that you've been through? Not particularly those ones exactly, but I try to avoid making enemies of people mm -hmm. or groups or ideas or whatever. Yes, don't make unnecessary enemies. Right? I mean, there's always parts of yourself that you can overcome. You know, if you need something to grapple with, you probably do. You can find that. You just look inside. You'll find something to grapple with. You know, inadequacy, weakness, susceptibility to temptation, narcissism, pride, envy, revenge, resentment, frustration, lack of faith, all of that. that that'll keep you occupied if you really grapple with it. And yeah, I mean, that's an ancient theological question. You know, what's up with the devil? Why, why, is the, why does the possibility of evil exist? Why is there an eternal adversary? Why would God, God construct a reality where an adversary exists? And maybe it's because all things considered, a world with an adversary is a better world, just like a garden with a snake in it is a better garden.